everyone so today I am going to do like a first impression of the Canon 80D and honestly this is so so different from my experience of other DSLRs because I still remember getting my Canon T3i which is like the OG YouTube camera and then I got it I tried it for like two of my videos I'm gonna link them in the info box but you will see why it is so different because for some reason, it just doesn't autofocus, and for someone like me, I'm not like super like technical or anything. It's like super difficult for me to deal with anything that is not autofocus, but this, it looks like it is autofocus. So if I go forward and then I go backwards. Yeah, it looks like it is autofocus, which makes me really, really excited. So my first impression of the Canon 80D is a win. And um, let me just explain to you which camera I used before. So. The camera that I used before it is the Panasonic Lumix GF7. So this is the camera I believe it is currently discontinued already. And I've been using this camera for I want to say like three plus years on my YouTube channel. So most of my videos, majority of my videos, they're filmed with this camera. And it's like super small, super lightweight, and manual you adjust magnification. Overall, I really like this camera because it has a flip screen. It's just easier when you're a YouTuber and you want to see if you're in focus or if the props are in focus, and it's just really, really handy. The one thing that I feel like Canon does like a way better job than the Panasonic Lumix GF7 is that for this one, both the SD card and the battery is in the bottom. So when I put it on a camera stand, which you know most YouTubers do, when I put it on a camera stand, I have to screw the whole camera out in order to change the SD card or battery if you know if the SD card is full or if the battery is empty or if if I ran out of battery. So this is one thing that is it's not that great, I want to say. Overall, I really, really like the GF7. I feel like it's just really, it feels very professional and looks really good too. And I'm going to show you some footages of the camera itself. Um, price point. So I bought my lens and my body separately because I heard that the lens that it comes with it doesn't look that good. So I might as well just skip on the lens that it comes with and just buy the body and then buy the lens, you know, on the side. The lens I'm using is a Sigma lens. It's like the super popular. I'm gonna put the specs here because I don't remember, but yeah, it's a super popular lens that most of the YouTubers use. So um, of course I'm on the bandwagon and I used it too. So I hope you guys enjoy this very quick first impression. If you wanna go like like, you know deeper than that please let me know I will definitely make like a deeper review video but right now it's just like a fresh literally I unboxed this like an hour ago and I was like cleaning around the place and all that trying to set you know my ring light up and all that so that took some time but literally it's fresh out of the box and I didn't look at the instruction or anything I just have turned on charge the battery of course and then start using it so this is like a very very fresh first impression not deep at all but please let me know if you want anything more than surface level I will definitely let you know after after you know trying it out for a longer period of time and I know this camera is like not that new anymore I don't know why in my mind I thought it's like a new camera I don't know why but yeah it's like three years old so it's not the newest technology but I think there's a reason why so many youtubers are still using it because I bet it's pretty pretty useful and pretty easy to use and it is like a pro consumer uh, what, what do you call it like prosumer or something yeah so it's like easy to use and it's um, for like consumers like the regular consumers to use. I do think it is super easy to use, super easy to set up, autofocus and everything. It's just so convenient and I like convenient things. So yeah, that's my little review of the Canon 80D. I hope you guys enjoy this video and if you do, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I have a lot of perks and benefits in my info box. Be sure to check those out and I will see you guys next time. Bye!